this is like the fifth time me recording this video my camera keeps on malfunctioning but welcome back to my channel today's video is gonna be a video that i've been putting off for a very long time i'm not gonna lie the last time i actually seriously cut my hair was about more than three years ago when i did the big chop so if you haven't seen that video yet go watch it but it's been about more than three and a half years since i did the big chop and my hair has grown out um about two months ago i did randomly cut my hair because i have been on the natural path so for the most part my hair is always wet and curly and so two months ago I realized I had some heat damage and I just randomly cut off the ends. So my hair is a bit uneven, but the length of my hair actually reaches still on my bum a bit. So, it just, just makes it to my bum. But last week when I washed and blow dried my hair, I wanted to see what the health of my ends were like. Because I noticed that there was some roughness in the ends and I didn't know what the cause for that was. And I had a look at the ends and I've got single strand knots which i hate and if you are a curly girl you will know exactly what i'm talking about it's basically when your hair has been in a curly state for long and you haven't detangled it then on a single strand a knot will form so i've got a lot of those on my strands and it actually makes my hair at the bottom of my hair makes the hair feel hard and then i've also got <laughs> i knew i had um single strand knots but i didn't know i've got split ends and so when I assessed my hair recently, I saw that they are split ends just about starting. So it's just that small. So we are going to cut them off before they split even further. It's the first time in about three and a half years that I've had split ends. And I've never had to cut my hair before, but now we are going to have to cut it. So we're going to try and cut off at least about three inches of my hair today. Also just to get it a little bit straight because like I said the ends are thinned out. But in the next clip I'm actually going to show you guys the state of my hair ends. video i didn't know that i had split ends because i'm always checking my ends and i never could never find split ends but i saw now that there are a few it's not a lot and it's not high up it's you can see it's just just starting out but we're gonna we're gonna have to it's gonna have to go so i am gonna take this hair bonnet off i did blow dry my hair last night and I am currently using like the coconut oil and conditioner treatment on my hair. And it's making my hair feel so soft. You can see that my hair is enjoying this treatment. I don't have a professional hair cutting scissors. I don't have a sears. So it's just going to be any scissor that I'm going to use to cut my hair with today. My hair is also a little bit thinner because like I said about two months ago, I just randomly cut off. So I've got shorter pieces in between, which also makes the hair a little thinner. So I think for today, we're going to cut in here because that is where it's starting to thin out. So this is what we are cutting off today. Right, so this is my hair now. So I am going to cut about 3 inches off. My hair grows about 6 inches a year, which is about this much. This is how much my hair grows in a year and so one two three which is where my hair is at now um because it's been about more than three years since i did the big chop so my hair grows about six inches in a year i'm gonna try and cut three inches off now so that my hair can be at the same length just about reaching my bum in december that's the reason why i'm making this video because there are some methods and techniques and things that i want to incorporate for the next six months to see if it's going to help my hair grow 
a bit thicker because I need volume now. I need the ends that I've cut off to just grow out as quick fast as possible. <laughs> Why didn't you guys stop me when I did that? But anyway, so let's start. Uh, make a path um, and then path doesn't have to be straight. So let's go all the way down. There you go. So this is where my hair hangs in front. It is over my breast that goes about here. I wish I could make a mark here on this top so that I can just wear the same top again when I do the length check in December. But this is where the hair goes. I would say it is where, where my navel ends is where my hair ends. So just below my navel is where my hair ends. So we're gonna have to remember that. So you brush it through and then you have to keep it like this at an angle. I think this is it. Let's see. We're gonna have to cut you off. Uh -uh, goodbye. I was actually feeling there's more. There's another one. We're gonna randomly cut them. Just right there by the end. It just goes to show how high up these fairy knots went. There's another one. So that is how we're gonna measure the hair when I do my length check next time. I'm gonna wear exactly the same clothes and the tops and everything. And so the hair was cut to where it ends over here where the top ends. So it's just below my boobs. Under the boobs where the top ends, that is where the hair ends. Guys, do not try this at home. <laughs> Don't try this at home. Don't try this at home, but I needed to cut my hair. And again, don't forget to check out my big chop video, which I um, posted on my channel, and which I did about three and a half years ago. If you are interested to see where my journey started. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey. <laughs> so um, yeah, I'm picking up and vlogging again. I haven't vlogged in a while. It's been a while. You said you vlogged yesterday. I made a video I didn't vlog. Uh, making a video is like a tutorial. It's like you saying, this is how I fix a car. Vlogging is taking the camera with you as you're going on your day-to-day -day activities like that. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. So, yeah. So I'm going to try and vlog a little yeah, this you should weekend. say like 100% because you're from that... So I'm gonna vlog yeah. a little over the weekend. Yeah, it was Leah's birthday yesterday. Yeah, the girl is ten years old today. No? Nine? She's nine, man. She's not ten. Don't because lie. when she's ten, must buy a phone. Yeah, nine you, years you old. Sit so, not, I'm not nine. <laughs> so we 
we're gonna take her out. It was her birthday yesterday, today is Saturday. And so we're gonna take her out. We're on our way to Canal Walk. We plan on going to the movies, going to like we've got all our things planned, right? But it's now like oh, just after six o'clock in the evening. <laughs> because her daddy once again decided this is now the perfect time to go out. So we're gonna see how much we can squeeze in between now and maybe nine o'clock tonight because I know most of the stores they close at nine o'clock. So that's where we are heading now and i'm recording on my phone so i do apologize for the quality that you guys are seeing um it's late at night and i'm recording on my phone so but hopefully once we're inside the mall so i can walk then you guys will get a bit of footage so and better light and better light as well yes that's right so yeah let's go to canal <laughs> Because it is a first world problem. There is DSTV. You can watch DSTV. But no, she wants Netflix. And Netflix takes daughter. Which we ran out of daughter. Why did we run out of daughter? Because she's watching YouTube all night. Now we don't have daughter. And now she's crying. I uh, just didn't make any sense. Didn't make sense? Huh? Are we not in the musical anymore? We didn't go in there with them. Oh, now tell me how it must be done. No, I just want to do it. I need some doctor. I'm getting tired. You're getting tired. Let me just take it off like this. Hi guys, it's the next day. It is Sunday today. It's Mother's Day today. So happy Mother's Day. If you are a mother and you are watching this, happy Mother's Day. May you have a blessed day with your family and with your kids and enjoy the spoils today. And that's exactly what we are going to do today. We're going to celebrate Mother's Day. We have arranged with um, my mother and with Sean's mother. The phone is going to fall. Apart. So we have arranged with Sean's mother and with my mother. Um, and we've basically booked them for the day. And we are going to take them out. It's a little bit, you know, last minute. Shall we? It's a little last minute. And um, we couldn't really find any places open to book, so we're just gonna go to the waterfront and see if there's any nice restaurants still open or still have that have spots left. Um, yo, I cut my hair yesterday and it looks so nice. And so I'm gonna get ready, and before we go pick up the mothers, we're gonna go to Bayside because there's a few things that we need to buy. Maybe we can squeeze in some Mother's Day gifts because we haven't bought Mother's Day gifts as yet. Um, and we're gonna go pop in there. So yesterday, we, last night, we went to the cinema with Leah. We took her to the cinema and we watched The Bad Guys. It was actually very, very entertaining. Um, both Jean and I enjoyed it so much, even though it's a kiddies movie animation. 
but we enjoyed it so yeah and then today we're just gonna go pop in at the mall we're gonna go to Bayside Mall and get some stuff there and then we're gonna go pick up the moms for the day the outfit of the day I just have this palazzo pants on I'm trying to, to suck in my stomach so that the rolls don't show so much so yeah I've got this palazzo pants on uh, I bought this on Sheen it was longer than this so I actually had to ask my mother to take it in a bit so it has been altered and then I've just got a bodysuit on which is this one also from Sheen and then the shoes are also from Sheen Here's Mother Day's gifts. I got my mother uh -huh. a puppet bag. Uh, where did come from? Puppet bag. Uh, a puppet. And just. And now it's yellow. It looks yellow from the phone, but it's orange. Puppet. And we're moving on to clothes. This part of the video was sponsored by Daddy and Auntie Ronal. So this is a pink. It's a puppet with nothing inside and plastic. Mr. Price. With boards. Open. So I got a mom jeans, 19, my size. This is comfy for the winter. And it's 11 to 12. So I've got a bomber jacket. Good. To live on the floor. So it's the final thing that I was looking for in the shop, but I think they didn't have the color I wanted. I did a dye dye blue and a baby pink one. So I like that. But it's dark pink. And this is 910 charcoal. It's chocolate. This is how it looks. Bomber jacket looks. And with the, the mom jeans too. Oh yes, the basket's done. I just put some of this. I don't know. We were looking for that see-through um, paper. But we couldn't find that. So we just ended up going with this. This is like a, an organza type of material. And then I just bought like the ribbons. And then you've got your little, oops, never mind the background. You've got your little goodie bag here with, with everything inside. One for Sean's mother and one for my mother. Then I also bought at Mr. Price a humidifier. Because I've been looking for a humidifier, but wait me, are you in the way? Hi, what happened here now? Okay, I don't think it's damaged. Um, I've been looking for a humidifier, but every time we go to the shop, I keep on forgetting to just buy one. And then when we got to the tools now at Mr. Price, I saw that there was one. It was 150 at Mr. Price. 160. It was 160. 160 at Mr. Price. Dream Sleep humidifier, and then you get your, um, your three flavors or fragrances in here as well. So you get lavender, lemon, and sandalwood. And I'm going to try it out now. They say blue, they go, okay. There's blue, okay, there's purple. Oh, it's so cool. Wow. I'm waiting for Jean. I'm busy falling asleep here. Now. This one's playing with my hair and I'm busy falling asleep. It's so nice. I missed this. Oh, because my hair was always curly and I wouldn't let the children play with my hair. But before I went natural, I used to let Leah and Luba play with my ear. Just, just play with it. Oh, it's the best feeling in the world. <laughs> it's not just me that enjoys it. Like, I love that feeling of someone playing with my ear. Like, lightly, not brushing it hard. Just, like, lightly playing with it. Oh, it's so nice. Like, it's so calming for me. I can fall asleep like this. Like, I could sit up and just fall asleep. Wake up. Wake up. I'm 
Thank you so much. <laughs> I hope you're going to enjoy the lunch. We've enjoyed already. We need to sit on this chair yes. in this place. Yeah, it's yeah. not right. a job. Yeah. yeah. So See all the other implications. Mother said, could have been here. Yeah. 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 I said, fruit. And then he came with that. You guys don't know what this means. Oh my word, oh, what's hanging on here? What's hanging on here? Happy Mother's Day. You're supposed to come through the room. Look at the toilet. What is one? They all look the same.